Hello everyone, welcome to Elder Grace YouTube channel. So last session we will talk about how to so, edit the screenshot using this take screenshot activity. So screenshot edit the purpose of the screenshot edit the purpose. There are two reasons. One is exceptions are we will screenshot and edit the email attached. In order to reporting purpose, we will screenshot and edit the email attached. Okay, this is the purpose. And the screenshot is the previous session. We will store the exception screenshot in the folder. And in this particular session, we will store the orchestrator storage bucket. So, the orchestrator storage bucket is the Ethereum. So, it is a cloud centralized storage location. So, we will store the empty storage bucket. So before that वंदन ना इन द टेक स्क्रीन चार्ट अभी ना जस्ट कॉपी पने करें सो सेम वर्कफ्लो दा वंदन ना यूज़ पने पोरा एंड कॉपी दिस वर्कफ्लो एंड अगेन पेस्ट इट एंड देन रीनेम इट सो ना इन्ना रीनेम पने ना टेक स्क्रीन चार्ट विथ स्टोरेज पैकेट ओके स्टोरेज पैकेट नाउ ओपन दिस सो we have a similar activity in our previous session, we use the same activity Just to use the same activity, go to activity panel and type storage Ok, so storage, orchestrator storage bucket, so we have these many options Delete storage file, download storage file, list storage file, read storage text and upload storage text, storage file and write storage text so, we have already read the storage text. So, we have to use the config file and config data in the storage bucket. So, we have to access the storage bucket. So, if you want to know more about read storage text, then you can go here. And so, in the playlist, you can check the playlist. So, go to playlist in the particular 2023 playlist. And you have this. So in the particular session on the how to read config file from storage bucket in the particular session on the refer panico and now let me so drag and drop just in upload storage file of interactivity on the drag and drop panano. So edhika gana na on the in odia screenshot on the storage bucket la upload panano. Okay just drag and drop and so in the upload storage bucket we have to provide a couple of information correct so destination and output file path so in the path then storage bucket name and go to your orchestrator go to your tenant and go to storage bucket so there is no storage bucket here so what we have to do we have to create a one a storage bucket so click on a storage bucket so now in the test process just process name on the ending on the future on the perfect up on a good day process name on the new put the clock now test process have been good then then you have to provide a description then label then click on add Okay, test process and solitary storage bucket name create when you actually just copy this storage bucket name and go to here and within double quotes paste it. Okay, then I'm in a corner destination on the group. Okay, now so destination on the end of the path in a file order name. Okay, now so within a storage bucket number on the end of file name on the test store of no up in the and then on the path on the we have the same path. So, okay, now so out. Put screenshot file path. So, we will put the screenshot and the entire path here. So, we will put the upload storage file here. So, we will put the path here. So, we will upload the storage file here. So, we will put the file name here. So, file name here. So, file name here. So, file name here. In the entire path here. We have to get only file name. Correct? So, we will put the file name here. Screenshot. Then followed by yymmdd. So, in the format add up mode. This file name will be different. So, we will get the file name. So, then drag and drop assign activity. And so, here create a variable. Control K. Str file name. Enter. 
and uh, so the value lo nama enna provide pannom appdi pathina just or a simple ana or syntax tha so path okay path get file name path dot get file name open bracket then out screenshot file path okay so nam in the entire uh, file path la irundhu only file name mattum get panna porom okay click okay then go here in the destination call your str file name okay that's it okay now go to orchestrator so here one the, there is uh, no file uh, within the project folder na enna panna porena ipo vandha na run panna pora so let's see okay so in the screen vandha na vechikuren so then then go here and click on run file so ipo screenshot eduthaachu so and the screenshot vandha neenga just so ingiyum paakalam so the same same screenshot vandu ungalku storage bucket load a irukku appdi paapom okay so go to orchestrator and refresh yeah you have a screenshot so ninga enna pannona just download it so once download aanone just open it so open pannone ungalku end screenshot vandha eduthichu adha vandu upload pannu okay so this is all about how to store uh, your screenshot uh, within a uh, storage bucket so idu vandu screenshot mattum illa so idhe same uh, format da namu vandu uh, upload storage file da vandu use pannanum for reason ninga end file vandu ninga upload pandradha andalum so in the particular activity in the particular uh, options vandu uh, utilize pannanum okay so next session la so uh, email notification vandu epdi send pandradhu so அதுக்கப்புறம் ஸோ எப்படி வந்துட்டு இமெயில் நோட்டிஃபிகேஷன் டேக் ஸ்க்ரீன்ஷாட் அண்ட் யூனிட் ஆல் செட்டிங்ஸ் இது எல்லாமே கம்பைன் பண்ணி வித்தவுட் ஆட் கோட் ஸோ எல்லா ஆப்ஷன் எல்லா பாட்டுக்கு தேவையான இன்புட் எல்லாமே கான்ஃபிக் ஃபைல் வந்து ரீட் பண்ணி ஒரு ப்ராசஸ் எக்ஸிக்யூட் பண்ணி அந்த ப்ராசஸில் வர எக்ஸப்ஷனை கேப்சர் பண்ணி ஸ்க்ரீன்ஷாட் கேப்சர் பண்ணி ஒரு இமெயில் எப்படி அனுப்புது அப்படின்றத பற்றி லாஸ்ட்டாக வந்து பார்ப்போம் ஸோ பிஃபோர் தட் ஒன்லி இமெயில் நோட்டிஃபிகேஷன் எப்படி சென்ட் பண்ணுறதுன்றது நெக்ஸ்ட் செஷனில் பார்ப்போம் தேங்க்யூ Thank you.